When the architects visited Miami and spoke to our students about what they would like inside the Armstrong Student Center, they were impressed by the energy of the students and they saw it through architecture to amplify that energy. One of the features that they've used architecturally is to provide lots of glass walls. The glass walls make it possible for students to see each other day and night to be able to make that connection whatever and whenever it might be so that their energy and the opportunities for working with each other are very, very much easy to do and an important part of the student experience. I mean, how can you not be excited about the Armstrong Student Center opening? It allows students to experience everything the campus has to offer. This is new for Miami and for Miami student body. A place on campus just for students, run by students for the students. So I think this is an amazing time for Miami and it just reinforces that we put our undergrad education above everything else here. On the upper level of the Student Center, is Pooley's Diner, which is a 50s themed uh, diner that will be open very late night. Miami Ice is uh, house-made gelato. One of the flavors of gelato that we've been testing has scored extremely well with the students. A little unusual, you have to try it, but it's cereal milk gelato. And the biggest concept for us was Main Street. We have a pho noodle station, and a pho noodle station is a Vietnamese noodle station. These noodle stations are absolutely taking the country by storm and we're excited to have one on our campus but that's a great example of a concept that is ground up designed by students on this campus. We're looking forward to the opening of the Armstrong Student Center and we hope you are too. The Armstrong Student Center will enrich student life on Miami's campus in ways we've never seen before. I'm excited for the Wilkes Theater because it's going to offer a great venue for all the different student performance groups on campus. I'm most excited for all the open space, whether it's the light from the windows or the high arched ceilings or the rooftop terrace, the shade family room, just all this student activity in one space. I can't wait to see the Wikiami room. I think it's gonna be really neat. It's actually a circular room, so everybody in the room will be facing each other while they're talking. So I think it really creates a good environment for discussion because there's no one in charge of the room. Everyone is an equal. So I think that's gonna be really neat. And it's also gonna be themed with the Miami tribe, which I think will be really cool as well. I'm most excited about all of the new food concepts, especially at the Late Night Diner. Miami will finally have a building at the heart of its campus where students can come 24 hours a day, 7 days a week. The Shade Family Room will be like the family room of the university where anyone can come and hang out, do homework, or just catch up with friends. So I can't wait to have that space on campus. I think everyone who has the chance to walk through or observe the Bicentennial Rotunda will feel a special emotional connection to our history. That history and this mission is what defines Miami. And this place symbolizes that deep, long, and very special relationship that we have with all of those who come before us and all of those who would come after us.